Picture this. You're Jason Sudeikis, just minding your own business, probably pondering the deeper meanings of Ted Lasso, when suddenly you're ambushed by a horde of Sharpie-wielding fans. How does one respond? Apparently, with a hint of fear and a dash of comedic bewilderment. Who knew signing autographs could be a spooky experience? Imagine the faces of these fans. They're lining up, autographs in hand, and then Jason, out of nowhere, confesses, you guys are scaring me. I mean, can we blame the guy? It's like Halloween came early, only instead of candy, everyone wants your signature. Eek. Here's a thought. What if Jason started carrying around a smoke bomb? Picture him disappearing into a puff of smoke every time fans approach. One minute there's Jason, the next, poof. Just a cloud of mist and confused autograph seekers left in his wake. Quite the magician act, huh? Let's break this down. Imagine you're Jason, signing away, when you look up and there's a sea of expectant faces. It could be like an impromptu horror film, where the plot twist is everyone wants your autograph and your sanity. Cue the eerie music and dramatic close-ups, and the autographs keep pouring in. Perhaps Jason should start a support group for celebrities who are overwhelmed by overzealous fans. Meetings every Tuesday, snacks provided, and plenty of tissues for the emotional toll of constant Sharpie assaults. I mean, seriously, who would have thought Jason Sudeikis, the man who brings us endless laughter, would be the one running scared from fans? Maybe his next role should be in a horror comedy, Attack of the Autograph Seekers. The tagline, no one can hear you scream over the Sharpies. So here's the million dollar question. If you were one of those fans, would you still ask for an autograph after knowing he's slightly freaked out? Or would you bring a smoke machine and give Jason the ultimate high five for handling fandom like a pro? Like and subscribe, please.